It's been 18 years since 11-year-old Carly Bruscia was kidnapped and murdered in Sarasota. Keeping her memory alive has now become a special cause for a group of students and their instructor. As Fox 13's Kimberly Cuisan reports, the class is working to restore an old garden dedicated to the young girl. At Suncoast Technical College, Rob Wolf can teach you all the skills to complete a plumbing job. We put pipe together in a lab. In a Sarasota classroom, students also learn life lessons. It's all about having that empathy, that sympathy for others. Rob is a Sarasota native, and when someone reached out from McIntosh Middle School asking him to weld a butterfly back together for their garden, he said yes. But he was in for a lot more than that. Just looking at the condition of the place, Having four children of my own, it was, it was something that kind of got into my heart that we needed to do. The garden was dedicated 17 years ago in memory of Carly Bruscia. At 11 years old, Carly was abducted and murdered. Her story captured the attention of the country and now Rob's class. So we thought it would be a good project to honor Carly. Many hands make light work, but... It's, it's rough because everyone can only do a certain amount of things. We're all over. It's a big spot. For the past four months, they've repiped, re-irrigated, and are replanting and remulching the garden. We're happy to try and bring this back to where it was originally. It's very important in all of our hearts. They've had some donations and have also spent money out of pocket. They hope to finish the garden by May. It's important to pass on uh, her legacy and let people know what happened. Carly lost her life 18 years ago. Rob and his class want to make sure she is never forgotten. Some of these students that I have weren't even born when this all happened. Even though a bad thing happened, we can do good by keeping her memory alive. In Sarasota, Kimberly Quizon, Fox 13 News. Well, the students are in need of extra mulch and plants to get the job done, and that'll cost several more thousand dollars. They hope to finish before the end of the school year, then have a rededication ceremony with those who originally planted that garden.